Hello YouTube and welcome back. It's me Fruit Guru. I hope you're all taking care of yourselves. I hope you're all enjoying the grind, not only in Lab Ragnarok Labyrinth, but whatever game you're playing. Uh, I hope it's going well for you. And today I'm celebrating, and uh, it's kind of a small celebration, but I have finally hit 100 subscribers. And uh, I know this sounds kind of small, because there's people out there with thousands, hundreds of thousands, even millions of uh, subscribers. But for me, this is a really big deal. I've been making videos for a little over six months, and um, it's been slow watching that count should go up. And really, uh, it's a bit bittersweet because I had to kind of make a decision. Uh, I've obviously now, I've got the uh, War of the Visions videos and I've got my uh, Ragnarok Labyrinth videos. And I've had a look at the analytics and judging from what I've seen from those is uh, some of you watching this will know me from my War of the Vision stuff, but the majority of you watching this will know me from my uh, Ragnarok stuff. And I've only been making that for a week. When I started this uh, content, this channel, uh, I got about 70 subscribers over the case of the six months of making War of the Visions videos, and I've had 30 in the last week. So proportionally, I mean, the content that I make for uh, Ragnarok, it's just more in demand, it's, it's better received, uh, and I, I think I just reach a wider audience because there's a lack of English-speaking uh, kind of content creators for this game. Uh, and it's kind of nice to be wanted, <laughs> you know? Like, uh, War of the Visions, I think the biggest problem I have is I got into the game late, there were already, and still are obviously, so many great content creators for that game. I mean, I can't name you all, uh, but I watch you all. Dr. Diggs, obviously huge. Uh, Cabbage, I watch you. Orange J, I watched you, I briefly spoke to you once. Um, a load of them, and basically I um, can't really find a niche there. I didn't want to keep like regurgitating the same stuff. I mean, there's only so many people that can cover the news. Uh, I did try and do my build stuff, but you know, it's hard to build up units in that game, like on mass. So there's only so much I can cover there as well. And I found myself kind of going through these uh, lulls of uh, kind of weeks where I'd record stuff and I'd look at it, and I wouldn't really be happy with it. I was just making it for the sake of making a video, and it didn't feel great. Uh, so I. I wouldn't put it up and uh, all in all I, I couldn't really grow the channel from it so when this game came out Ragnarok Labyrinth um, I noticed that there were like hardly any resources out for it uh, and I really struggled actually because of that as I'm always saying and it wasn't until I actually joined a discord and kind of found out more that I was able to get a grasp on the game and I figured well if I'm struggling with this other people are probably uh, struggling with it as well so um, I may as well kind of uh, share what I have learned and keep sharing what I'm learning as I go along in the hopes that it reaches other people, and it has. I mean, the feedback has been great. Thank you for the comments and everything. I mean, I, it's been really, really nice to actually hear people appreciate it. Uh, I'm not, I'm not going to say I'm not used to it, but uh, it's, it's just I'm not used to it uh, this much. So thank you. Uh, it's, it's been really, really cool. And uh, I want to say a special thank you to the people who watched my War of the Vision stuff and subscribed along the way and, and liked it and stuff. Uh, you guys, I wouldn't have made it as far as I did without you. I know there weren't a huge amount of you, but uh, every little like, every little comment, even every view, it, it meant a lot to me. It kind of made it all worthwhile. So uh, thank you once again. Um, despite the fact that I'm not going to be making more War of the Visions content, doesn't mean that I've forgotten about you guys. You guys kind of launched my channel um, to what it is now, and hopefully it'll keep growing. But uh, yeah, I, I really appreciate what you guys have uh, done for me in the past. And to all you people who've come in for the Ragnarok content, thank you so much. You made this a very easy decision, to be honest. Uh, it's just nice to know that uh, people actually kind of want to watch this and kind of need this content. And as I said, like, I don't want to be making stuff for the, the sake of just putting out videos. I want to actually be doing stuff that helps people. Uh, and I have kind of found a niche here where I can provide that. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's pretty exciting. Um, and I hope, I hope we keep growing. Uh, I hope I'm able to kind of keep sharing good information. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's that's all there is to really say about it. Uh, on another note, I have started a guild in this game. Ooh, promotion time, right? Uh, <laughs> if you've watched my other Ragnarok stuff, you'll probably know I mentioned the Milk Discord community a lot. This isn't my community, uh, just for the record. It's, it's one I joined to find stuff out. And uh, I joined a few of them, and this one was by far the most welcoming, friendliest community. Uh, there was no bad attitude or anything. People were just really nice. Uh, I'm going to put the link in the description, of course, uh, and I highly recommend if you're looking for a community to join. You don't have to join my guild, uh, but join this community. People are really sound there. Uh, they'll help you out. Uh, it's been a godsend to me. Cannot thank them enough. 
<laughs> so yeah, I mean, I guess that's it really. And uh, if you do come on, you'll see there's an application. The guild's called WW, not to be confused with the other guild called VV. I know I probably overcomplicated this by choosing this name, but I thought they worked well together. So uh, yeah, that's kind of the reasons why I picked it. So uh, we're going to be a, a semi kind of hardcore guild to start with. Um, kind of obviously daily players uh, would be preferred and get the first kind of choice in. Uh, you don't have to be like no lifing it, but uh, obviously you want to be progression minded. Uh, we will be kind of uh, gearing up to be a more competitive guild as time goes on and we kind of find out what we're doing. Uh, I don't want to launch this and just say, oh yeah, we're super competitive because there's not much to be competitive about right now. Like the game's just started. So I'm trying to be realistic. So if you think that sounds good to you, please come in, uh, shoot me a DM. Sh I'm called Fruit on the server. Uh, if not, just put an application in the channel. There's a template there to follow and I'll get back to you. Uh, I'd be more than happy to have uh, people. So yeah, Thank you very much for watching. Again, thank you to my War of the Visions viewers. Uh, again, as I said, you won't be forgotten. Uh, and thank you so much to all the new people who have come in from my Ragnarok stuff. Uh, I hope you stick around. That's it. Fruit Guru out. And happy 100 to us. Eh? <laughs> Bye.